Hi, I'm Riley Levin. You may recognize me from some of the videos that we've made. And today, the whole point of these interviews is to make people feel uncomfortable. Today, we have special guest Bill Bendig here with us. Thanks for being here. Yeah, thanks, sir. So I want to ask you a couple questions, Bill. Number one, how do you get that beard of yours to be so luscious? If you want the honest truth, my girlfriend's got a kid and I steal the kid's shampoo. Okay. My second question. When you take a shit, do you wipe ass to crotch or crotch to ass? Crotch to ass. Nice. <laughs> so one of the most notorious advices you've ever given people was you had to fuck at least one fat chick in your life. Now, do you still live and by that rule? Yeah. You do? I did, yeah. Did you? I'm changed man now. Are you? I'm married. I, I did hear that. I heard you have a kid now, too. A stepkid, yeah. Step -kid. Same thing. Well, I'm happy for you, buddy. Thank you. It means a lot coming from fucking you. <laughs> so, Bill, by a man with many stories, what is one of the most worst drinking memories you've ever had? My worst drinking memory? Or the most fun? Dude, I don't know. I've done a lot of things. <laughs> I got drunk at my graduation party and tried to jump over the pool siding and almost took the whole pool down. <laughs> I remember that. I've done a lot of things. Now, I can consider both of you and I fat people, right? I'm uh, fluffy, but yeah, go on. Oh, fluffy, fat, same thing. You're fat. I am fat. So are you. No. Go ahead, though. Fluffy. But now, is it true that all fluffy people have tiny dicks? No, fat guys do. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of question is that? <laughs> told you I'm not fat. <laughs> Now, before our time is up, was, is there anything that you'd like to ask me? I got well, a few questions. So I'll leave the best one for fucking last. The first one is your pops is Jewish and you have a St. Michael's fucking tattoo on your arm. He's a Catholic fucking guy. Can you explain that? I can. Because I'm Jewish. All right, that makes no fucking sense. Second, speaking of tattoos, I see you have a fishing tattoo on your arm. <laughs> Being a fisherman myself, I've never seen you catch a fish. You're kidding me. I'm not kidding you. It's kid killed me. The third one is, is this fucking interview over? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, thank Thanks you. for coming out. This is Bill Bending, people. Go fuck yourself. So that last interview with Bill Bending was amazing. Super funny. But the next person we're going to have a special guest here on uh, this episode is Haley Pondo. And we can have Haley Pondo come to the stage. Hi, how's it going? Uh, Thanks good. for being here. Of course. So Haley Pondo, first question. How old are you? 18. 18. Good thing she's 18 or else she couldn't be here. Her second question. What is that black thing on your face? My nose ring? Sure it's not something else? Like what? <laughs> so Haley, why are you wearing holy pants? It's not Sunday. Man, I don't know what to tell you. Do they just look good? So Haley, I have to be honest with you. I've heard lots of stories about you. One of my questions is what type of man do you prefer? I don't discriminate. That's a good answer. That's a good answer. What did you have to eat this morning? I didn't eat anything. You didn't eat anything? Nope. Hmm. When you take a shit, do you wipe ass to crotch or crotch to ass? Neither. Yeah. You're, you're like Kim Jong Un, no asshole people. I'm joking. I can't breathe. Who was your last boyfriend? Do we have to go there? We don't have to, I was just curious. Now, are you currently at the moment talking to any other guys? Nope. Single. <laughs> My next question. Oprah Winfrey, Bernie Sanders, and your sister. You have to kill one, marry one, fuck one, go. <clears throat> kill Oprah. O Oprah. <laughs> what the Oprah? fuck's her name? Oprah. <clears throat> um, I'll marry Lulu. Okay. And I'll fuck Bernie, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he can't even get a fucking erection. <laughs> <laughs> he has to pay you to fuck him now. He pays me? Yeah, he has to. So okay. 
At least I'm getting paid. Socialism. Socialism. <laughs> so Haley, what is your whole intake on this coronavirus? Um, it's a little scary. Yeah. But like, I think I'll survive. Okay. Is you? It, maybe not. Maybe not. Probably not. <laughs> is your family in quarantine right now? Nah. No. I mean, Let's I just see. got back from Mexico, and I'm sitting right here. <laughs> so my next question, Haley. Does me being in a Speedo interviewing bother you? I'm just too used to it. Oh, that's wonderful. Honestly. Now, before my last question, I have one left. Yes. What is your most memorable moment with me? Or hmm. one of the weirdest moments? I have to say, that night that we were at Nick Frontera's house, and we were like drinking, and you start trying to dance on his mom. I do remember that. Well. <laughs> that was a good question. I forgot about that. So before you leave here today, Haley, is there anything you'd like to ask me? Yeah, I just have one question. Yes. Is it true that fat guys have small dicks? No, fluffy guys do. Well, thank you for being here today with us. Of course. Pleasure. So the next person we have coming on set is Wade Huff, one of our partners for HJO Productions. Hey, buddy. What's up, buddy? Thanks for being here today. You're welcome. I mean, you're always here, but thanks for being here. You're welcome. So, Wade, I just have to ask, what is your view on this whole HJO Productions thing that we are doing? I think it's awesome. I think it is awesome, too. Some of it's very stupid. Yeah. Like, Some of it probably won't work. Like now. But, just wait. Yeah. It's going to get a lot better. You hear that, guys? Just you wait. So, Wade, this is the first time that you're actually up in front of the camera. How do you feel about it? Pretty good. Pretty good? Yep. Well, that's good. So, my next question. Would you ever consider wearing a Speedo like myself? No. And going out in public? No. What about in the woods? No. In front of our friends? No. In front of me? No. See, I don't like to embarrass myself like you do. I don't consider That's why you're always in front of the camera, because you like to embarrass yourself. I don't consider this embarrassing myself. I consider this being one with nature. Oh, really? I, I Wearing do, a speedo. I do feel a lot free out well, here. Well, if you were considering being one with nature, then you'd just be butt-ass naked. You're right. I think I am going to do that. So wait, do you prefer to be the one behind the camera, or do you prefer to be the one in front? I don't mind being behind the camera. Okay. I kind of enjoy it. So we are missing one other person here today. Joseph Fartsmelly. Joseph Fartsmelly. We have no clue where he is. If we think he's down in Florida, but we don't know. If he's in Florida, he's dead. I don't know what is going on, but he should be here. It's a shame he's not. Yeah, it's a shame. But my next question is, are you uncomfortable of the scene in me in a Speedo? No. Okay, good. Weirdly. Weirdly. I, I should be uncomfortable, but you I'm not. You should be. You're right. Now, my next question. Would you mind if I touched your quim? On camera, yes. But not off camera? Not off camera, but on camera, yes. But what if I'm just trying to be a good friend? Well, that's off camera. Come on, I'm just trying to be a good... Off camera. All right, all right. Now, would you consider yourself fat or fluffy? Fluffy. Fluffy. I was fat, but now I'm fluffy. Fluffy? I consider myself fluffy. But, my next question is, from the jackass crew, who would you consider yourself? Probably Wee Man. Wee Man? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so is there a time that you can tell me that you can ever remember one of the worst drinking nights that you've ever had? What's one of the worst or most memorable moments? I don't, I don't think I've had a bad night with drinking, but one of the most memorable was when we were at your house. And, uh, yeah. So it what happened? Went, it went downhill in about 10 minutes. It did go downhill very fast. And, uh, I woke up next to some random chick, and you came upstairs, and you looked at me like Alan off of The Hangover. <laughs> And I knew we had a crazy ass night. <laughs> I don't remember shit. <laughs> I don't remember shit. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so if I was ever to die, what's one last thing that you could say to me? Hmm. 
I will tell you that me and Joseph Farsmelli, along with our colleague Bill Bendig, will keep HJL Productions up and running. Oh, I like that idea. Okay. My next question. Oh, oh, I forgot. And that you're Jewish. Can't forget that part. My next and one of the last questions I have for you is Joe Farnelli, Bill Bendig, and myself. You gotta, you gotta fuck one, kill one, marry one, go. I'm marrying Bill because he, he's already on dad status. Fuck Joe, and I'll kill you because you're already close to death anyway. That is true. <laughs> so, before this interview is over, is there any questions you'd like to ask myself? Do you wipe ass to crotch or crotch to ass? Personally, depending on the day, but 99% of the time, I wipe crotch to ass. What do you mean depending on the day? Don't worry about it. Well, thank you for being here with us today. Thank you for everyone that came out. I'm Riley Levin. I'm Wade Huff. This is HJL Productions. Now, if you excuse me, uh, I gotta go take a shit. So, uh, see you guys next time. Juice. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> off. <laughs> See, he wouldn't have said that. Yep, but she knows. She knows what she did. <laughs> she knows what she did. or didn't do. Yeah, in your case. Do. All right, I'll say. Bye, Bye, buddy. So, I want to interview you. Fuck, I messed up. So, I want to ask you a couple questions here today with us. Number one. How did you get your beard to be so luscious? You're gonna have to cut it, I wasn't ready. <laughs> right, you can cut that. I got the... So, back in high school, and we're still good friends to this day, but back in high school, I remember one of the best advices you've ever given me. You said, Riley, fuck anything with a pulse. Oh no, I can't put that in there. Fuck. The point is, is it true? All fluffy people have small bit. But fuck you, Bix. Fuck you. <laughs> now, Haley, you, 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 fuck! You can cut that, I messed up on that. Bill, wait, why are your pants off, Bill? Oprah Winfrey, Bernie Sanders, and your sister. You gotta fuck one, marry one, kill one. Why are your pants off? <laughs> what the fuck? So, my next Haley question, Haley. Fuck. So who we have next coming up on the uh, the set is Wade Huff, one of our partners for HJL Productions. Oh God! What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> Come on, asshole!